Hi all, my name's Marlon, the channel's Old Fart Hacks, and what we're working on here is finding out why this is still binding up. As you can see, I've got the Gibbs actually quite tight. The table's solid, and it moves just fine until we hit here. Then it binds up. It was worse than this. I found a, an area under here, so we're just going to continue to work here. Now, I'm not going to go through the whole grinding and all that crud, but I did want to start showing what's needed to get these things to work smoothly. It's basically finding the spots where the machining is not quite correct. Right now, we're talking clearances of under a half a thousandths here, less, perhaps even less than that. Anyway, so as I said, this smooth slides smoothly till there. It does bind up, and I'm sure it's just some little point there. So I'm going to stop this video at this instant. I'm going <laughs> to make this a finely fettled part and come back to it, and I'll show you what happens after I do that. Okay, anyway, if we look right here, you can see that this area right through here stands out more than the rest. This is, I believe, where my bind on this section of the table is occurring. Again, I'm not going to make you guys sit here and watch me sand on this thing and grind on this thing. But um, I've taken that down a little bit further. If you recall the last time, the table was stopping right here at the edge. Well, now it moves past that point before it binds. So it's just a matter really of clearing this away and perhaps, I don't know, there may be something over on the other side. I've got to look there. But this is the, the process. It's just rinse, repeat, and do it some more, and then rinse, repeat, and do it some more until it moves smoothly. We'll continue this in a bit if I can get this all done up. Okay, and this is about as far as I'm going to take this. Um, the gibs are tight. There's no wiggle in this. There's no wobble in this. It's good and snug. At least I believe it is. Maybe there is a little wobble in that. I may have to get to work on that. Hmm. Interesting. Because there's no wobble that way. There's a wobble vertically. Maybe I don't have this as good as I thought. Let's see. Even with the gibbs down absolutely tight, there's still that wobble. That's interesting. Mind you, the writing surfaces here are virtually just the gibbs on the ways. It's. But anyway. If I loosen the gibbs up ever so slightly and bring them in until they just snug, this now slides as far as I want it to go. So it comes down to, on these tables, just a little bit of fitting. The bind point was, again, right through here. And you can still see just a little step of a shadow there. But anyway, I think I'm hap reasonably happy with what I've got now in the way of motion here in this lowest stage. This will work in over time a little bit more. But at least that's stable and tight. So again, name's Marlon, the channel's old part hacks. I hope your day goes great. And of course, as always, make sure you don't get caught, because until you get caught, it's all good, right? Bye. So, I lied. Okay, fine. Um, in a little further consideration, I realized that this edge was entirely too sharp. Coming down into this V, it was striking on the bottom of the V, instead of letting these two surfaces come into contact. So the trick here is I'm 
filing a little bit more because again you can take a quarter you can take this in a quarter of an inch it won't affect the performance of the of the uh slide whatsoever but you certainly don't want to bind up on this little edge here so yeah i lied anyway so this is the sequel to the or the uh sequencer whatever to the uh, video I just did, which I'm going to attach to the video I just did. And again, Marlon, old fart hacks. If you like, please give me a like, maybe even a subscribe. Good night, all.